What's up, everybody? We are back. We're still on 12.3.6. I did my one-time check for the day this morning at 10.48, and we missed it. Still waiting for that spring rollout. Now, they consistently do big pushes. If you check on Testify, they kind of push out maybe 2,000 at a time. That's kind of what I see, at least for the Testify members. So they do these pushes and big rollouts. So we will see when we get it. I am curious. Have you got the new UI yet? This is supervised full self-driving. We're on 12.3.6. We're heading to Aspire Copy in route 1.1 miles. I want to test out the U-turn again. Let's check out our settings. We got to get an insertive. Minimal lane changes off. And we also have the autopilot set speed offset turned on. Beta is controlling all the speed. It's controlling all the driving and I will be supervising. Let's see how it goes. I hope you're having an amazing day today. I believe they're gonna be rolling out 12.4 to employees possibly this weekend. That's what it's seeming like on X. Let me know if you're on X, by the way. If, if you are, subscribe to, uh, to Vegas Model 3. Or follow me on there. I don't do too much posting, but I want to in the future. All right, we are in the wrong lane. We want to go straight here. So we're in the turning lane. We've got a car right behind us. Need to merge over. Let's see what FSD does. I want to say it's been missing this left turn lane quite a bit. We do have law enforcement behind us. I mean, in front of us. Let's see. I think I'm going to have to cancel again. Let's go ahead and cancel. I just don't want to go straight through here. I know a beta will just go straight through. That's for sure. In the wrong turning lane. All right, looks like it is our turn. We are hesitating. And I might go and goose it just a little bit to get it to go. All right, very good. And the question is, will we have all these bugs squashed on 12.4? I don't know. I'm wondering if we'll have these bugs squashed on the 14.3 or 14.6 rollout that's going out right now. Slowing down for construction. Got a big trench in the road. Now we do want to merge all the way over and we're going to perform the U-turn. Again, we have it on assertive, minimal lane changes off. This should give FSD the best chances of doing as many aggressive maneuvers as possible. Let's see. Nice little Model X there. And we are going for it. We do have security pulling out and I don't know if they see me or not. I guess they do see me. I'm gonna go and wave him on. This is probably the third time he's seen me here filming. <laughs> All right, now we're stuck in this 10. Again, I'm gonna go, I mean, we're doing 15 and a 10. I don't think it's, I'm gonna speed it up just a little bit and keep my foot on the accelerator. Let's, I still have my foot on the accelerator. Kind of see what's going on when I let it off. Okay, so I now did hold 23. Very slow. We'll have to test this out as well on the next update. So we are pulling into a Spire copy. I'm going to give it a little more throttle. This guy's right behind me. He's like, I thought I drove slow. And we're pulling in. While we're here, let's test out Auto Park. We're going to hit right between these two cars. Let's try it right here. All right, got to do the full stop. Ooh, motorcycle. One and two. Looks like he's moving, but he is parked. Go ahead and end this trip. See if we can get in there in one shot. And can you guess where we're going next? I'll give you a couple seconds. All right, pull it in, pull it in tight. Oh, we're going to have to re calibrate see i feel like that was that error shouldn't have happened we definitely had the motion in the steering wheel we could have cocked it tighter that's a fail on my book if you can't pull it in one shot in 30 seconds it's a fail let's go what do you guys think i'm curious what you think about auto part oh no what are we doing so we got we got cocked in here and we're doing another three-point turn wow i don't like that auto park in progress press bake break to pause i haven't actually tried that i'll try that later on next one all right after 10 tries we made it and navigate to chipotle 
I think I'm gonna mix it up today. And go and put it in put it in drive. Wait for FSD to charge up. It does have a few dots here. That means that the battery is not completely warmed up, which is interesting because it's a pretty hot day day to day. All right, let's engage. Pulling out of here. We don't have much visibility. All right, clear to the left. Let's pull it tight. I don't like this maneuver. We should have just went right to the left. Oh no. Yeah. Not too intuitive there. And this is Aspire copy. Everyone's hanging out, getting work done. Maybe. All right, we're pulling out. So about 2.8 miles, seven minutes on route to Chipotle. And I'm getting, today I'm getting white rice, pinto beans and chicken. I think that's what I'm gonna do. All right, let's pull out beta. Let's do it. Got a creep line, which is pretty much just a, just a line out there. I've never seen FSD on 12.3.6 use that creep line. Now, what are we doing here? We're going straight, kind of hesitant pulling out. We still got that 10 speed limit. Now it just bumped up to 25. I'm not sure where that 10 mile an hour comes from. All right, after this Nissan, it's our turn. Perfect trajectory, timing. Good acceleration, not as fast as it was two weeks ago on this same update. They dialed it back. So that's the question right there. If they dialed the speed back, which I've noticed on the autopilot set speed offset without an update, that just gives me the clues that they can really just toggle any switches. I definitely think they're doing some in the background. They need to toggle off the switch that shows the hesitation and the lane change and just cut that out. He's head, heading south on the 95. Let's check it out. So we'll be getting on and off the freeway, take the ramp, heading to Chipotle. I would take the city streets, but I want to test out V11 on the highway. It's been really squirrely lately. And I did also read that pretty soon, maybe in 12.5 or 12.6, that it'll be one stack possibly on the freeway. For the, so V12 may merge. I think that's what Elon was saying on next today. And we got the green light. I just want to take a moment to really appreciate the visualizations. They've really dialed them in, dialed them in for sure. You used to see cars kind of jumping around quite a bit, but it's much better now. And I feel like it's only getting better. Got the red hands. I was looking, I'm holding the steering wheel. Been getting more alerts like that lately. Not too bad diving into this lane, a little hesitant. And we are merging. We're still on the highway stack. I mean, on the V12 stack, when you see auto max, it does tend to go back and forth. Let's see. I want to say about three, 400 yards into the freeway, it usually flips over to the V11 stack. We're still on the city street stack. Kind of modulating the speed here, 52, a little slow. About right now, I'd want to gun it. Let me go and goose it to get it to go. So a little bit of a goose, and now it's starting to pick up speed. Let's get out of this right lane. I did have to do a disengagement yesterday. I'm gonna go ahead and put on the arrow this time. So I, I'm again, manually, I think it should have took initiative and it has in the past, but just lately it's failing right there. So I did put on the blinker and it did change lanes. Now we're gonna be exiting the freeway here. As always, I'll let you know if I do any interventions with the uh, uh, turn signals, throttle presses. If I disengage, the blue line will go away. Now this exit has been performing great. Yeah. You know, I guess one takeaway to talk about today that, that I've been thinking about is listen more than you speak. You know, I tend to talk over people sometimes in life. I just get very excited, but it's definitely something that's gonna be top of mind today. It's just let it go with the flow listen and think before I speak. All right, we are clear to the left. Ooh, we got on the brake there. Let's see what we're looking at. We are completely clear. And as this Jeep just kind of comes up from afar, we are not clear anymore. And we got another spot that opened. We got, ooh, aggressive traffic pulling in. I'll tell you when I think we can go. Not right now. 
I didn't intervene at all, but it's definitely not right now. We'd kind of jumped out. One, two, we still got a few cars. So we're sitting here patient. I don't think we have anyone behind yet. And we should be clear right after this truck. Two trucks. Yeah, we are clear. All right, perfect. FSD's inching out. Very good. I think it missed a couple opportunities there. And again, we are on aggressive or assertive. Not that aggressive today. They definitely dialed something back. That guy over there in the Tesla Model Y on the intersection almost seemed like he knows me. He's checking out the camera, I bet. I mean, you know, we all appreciate our uh, other Teslas driving around. Sometimes I wonder, though, if I saw someone with a camera filming, I know exactly what they'd be doing. And we got the green light. So when we pull into Chipotle here, I do want to test the auto park again, and I want to press the brake to pause it, to see if we can pause it and unpause it. I, I'm not too familiar with how that works, so I definitely want to test it out. We should be merging into the left lane here. I was almost going to change the route on the fly. Okay, we're hesitating once, and we got in. And we got the green light. Very long intersection. I think I almost fell asleep there. I had quite a few thoughts. We're going slow into this intersection, by the way. Very slow, too slow. In the past, it has dove into the bus lane and kind of just wants to go right there. I'm gonna give it some throttle to push it out. So it's definitely not going in there anymore since I reported that bug, but it does try to. And we're here in the bike lane. And we're gonna test out auto park pause. Should be pulling into the second one if I know beta. And thank you so much. Another quick video today. Let's go ahead and disengage right here. Did I actually miss the turn? Nope. I think I guess it was going for the next one today. But thank you so much for watching. I think today is day 48 of the 100 day challenge. And definitely subscribe, like, and leave your feedback. What do we got here? We got some interesting ones with a trailer sticking out. And we got another performance model three ahead of us. I almost thought it was a Luda, ludicrous for a second. All right, brake, park, start. I think we're pretty clear for traffic. We're gonna do the auto park brake pause once we get close to the, the, line, the parking spot. Let's see, kind of getting a little bit nervous. Like right when it gets close, I'm gonna press the brake. As long as we don't have no traffic around, we're doing good. Let's see, right here. All right, so I press the brake and then resume. I want to try it again. I'm going to press the brake, and then I want to press the brake again. Okay, so as soon as you press the brake again, it does uh, cancel auto part. So a pretty good test there. Interesting. I do like the brake to resume and then just resume on screen. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. You guys are amazing. Can't wait to see you on the next one, and have a great day.